Hi again, it's Miss Beth, and today I have Finders Keepers for our story time to go. And this is by Keiko Kazka, and it's published by Penguin. Finders Keepers. One day, a squirrel found a big acorn. Yay! Finders Keepers, he cried. I'm going to save this for later, thought the squirrel. So he dug a hole and buried it. Then he left his hat to mark the spot. You stay put, hat, said the squirrel. I'll be back tomorrow. Do you think the hat's going to stay put? <gasps> but once the squirrel had gone, the wind began to blow. It lifted the hat higher and higher until... It landed in a tree next to a little bird. <gasps> wow, what a terrific nest, cried the bird. Finders keepers. She snuggled into her new nest, but soon it began to wobble. It wobbled and wobbled until it fell into a nearby stream. The hat quickly floated along until, what do you think it'll become next? An ant spotted it. Yippee, what a nice boat, cried the ant. Finders keepers. The ant hopped on board and sailed on and on until splash. A big wave nearly turned the boat upside down. What was that? What is that? It was a bear. Hey, look at this. What a perfect clown nose, cried the bear. Finders keepers. Wearing his handsome red nose, the bear juggled and juggled until his nose started to tickle. Ah, ah, ah-choo! The bear's nose went flying. It flew and flew until finally it landed near a flower patch. The next day, the squirrel returned. There you are, he said to his hat, exactly where I left you. He dug up his acorn and happily munched away. Yummy. And that was the end of the story until someone else came along. What a cool hat, cried the snake. Finders keepers. And if you've been to the library to pick up some books at curbside pickup, you might have noticed we have a lot of squirrels hanging around the library this year. So if you want to check out some extension activities, look at the website or Facebook, and we'll see you next time.